The world nearly lost comedian Tracy Morgan last year in a traffic accident that claimed the life of his dear friend. Now, after nearly a year of difficult recovery, Tracy is speaking out for the first time in an exclusive interview with Matt Lauer. He, his lawyer and fiance, sat down with Matt in the Saturday Night Live studio, Morgan's first time back since the crash. You walk in this room, what do you think of? Home. Just being home. A lot of good memories. I'm Brian Fellows. How are you feeling? I have my good days and my bad days. Sometimes I don't feel well. Sometimes emotionally I don't feel well. I'm really focused on my memory coming back to me, my walking getting better, my balance is still off. So I have to really focus on those things. It was a terrible accident. The car flipped. It's on its side. What's the last thing you remember from that night? Saying a joke and looking at Jimmy Mack, and then um, wanting to get back to my wife. You two were actually talking. On the phone. As the impact occurred. Yeah. We were, we were on FaceTime, actually, but I didn't know that he was an accident. I just thought reception dropped. Once I found out the time of the accident, I realized I haven't heard from Tracy since that point. Tracy, mm -hmm. you mentioned a, a second ago Jimmy Mack, James McNair, who died in this crash. You didn't get to see him after the impact, did you? No. When did you learn he had passed away? A week after I came out of the coma, my lady leaned over to my bed and said, we, we buried Jimmy about a week ago. I didn't know how to take it. For a long time, we, we would discuss how, how to tell guilty him. he was feeling because of all the people who were there, and especially Jimmy Mack, yeah. wasn't even performing, just was there for him. Emotionally speaking, if you experience depression, how are you getting through that? I love comedy, and I wonder how I'm going to be funny again, remembering my identity. What do I do? And the fans let me know we can't wait for you to come back. We can't wait for you to come back, and I, I can't wait to make them laugh again. I want to say thank you to the people. Thank you very much for saving my life. They did. Thank they did. you. They did. Thank you. Thank you for me and my family. You know, it'd be a nice way to thank him. One day walking down those stairs again on Saturday Night Live. I promise you. I promise you. One day when I'm 100%, I'm going to grab that mic and I never going to let it go. Mm -hmm. Never. I'm going to be the funniest I can be because I ain't going to never take life for granted no more. Hey, NBC News fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and then click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.